Hello everybody, Shadow here, and welcome to Paper Mario! I have to read props today. I'm going to tell the story of star spirits and something wishes. I missed it. Far, far away, beyond the sky, way above the clouds. It's been said that there's a haven where the stars live. Nice! In the sanctuary of Star Haven. There rests a fabled treasure called the Star Rod, which has the power to grant all wishes. Oh, very cool. Using this wondrous Star Rod, the seven uh, revered star spirits watched over our peaceful world. Uh, carefully. Very carefully. That doesn't sound good. And then... Oh! Oh dear. What the... Who stuck that weird thing into the story? <laughs> yeah, I did! <laughs> oh boy, so I can, at long last, beat Mario. I'll take this star rod. <laughs> Do it, Cammy Koopa! This is going a bit too fast, which should not be a thing! It's not that much text! <laughs> no, you mustn't do that! Yeah, now let's try using it! Stop it! Cut it out, Bowser! Oh no! You're changing the story! <laughs> oh, was that Cammy? That probably was Cammy. That was a piece of cake! <laughs> I hate it when subtitles don't have who they're by. Now Star Kids may rise to the ha haven to deliver people's wishes, but those wishes would not come true. Whatever can they do? Oh, oh no. Well, <laughs> so yes, we are playing Paper Mario. Uh, I have never played this game. Uh, well, I've never beaten it. I, I have played it. However, it was back in like high school on my Wii. Uh, and that we died, so I could never finish it. <laughs> so, <laughs> we're just kind of out of luck. <laughs> so, we are playing on the Switch, but with the Nintendo 64 controller, which I let run out of batteries, so it's plugged in right now. <laughs> um, I figured because, um, the Thousand Year Door is being remade and comes out in like a month and a half at at the time of recording this anyway. Um, <laughs> I figured why not finally play this uh, and finally beat it. And then maybe we can do Thousand Year Door right after. So we're gonna just hop into it. Um, we are going to go with, let's just do Bam. I could do Shadow, but honestly Bam is faster. So I don't know. There's also just something about labeling it Bam that feels nostalgic for some reason. So, anyway, it's Mario's house. Mail call! I have not thought about any voices I'm doing. So, <laughs> these might not be consistent, by the way. Just keep that in mind. Hey, Mario, we've got a letter from Princess Peach. I'll read it to you, okay? What, you think I can't read? All right, let's see. <laughs> Why do you have to go right into frickin' Peach as well? I'm throwing a party at my castle today. Mario and Luigi, I would be honored if you could both attend... Many guests from distant towns are hoping to meet you. There will be tasty sweets and all kinds of entertainment. I hope to see you here soon. Sincerely, Peach. All right. I love a good party. So let's go. Woohoo! How to do it? Hello, Toad. Howdy, Toad. Hi, Toad. What's up, Toad? Toad, how's it going? 
All right. The castle. What a magnificent castle. I never get used to this place. It looks like lots of guests are already here. Okay, that's... Say, Mario, why don't you go see Princess Peach? I'll go later. I'm thinking I'll mingle for now. If you press A in front of the door up there, you can open it. Hi. Welcome to Peach's Castle. Oh, uh, do, do I really want to do a toad voice for every single toad? Mario, you're looking well. Please enjoy the party, okay? Wow, I've never seen so many guests from different parts of the world in one place. I'll bet you could hear some stories uh, about places you've never been to, huh? I'm gonna try to do sort of a toad voice, but also like, not so scratchy. <laughs> Hello. Hey, uh, Mario, I hope you brought an appetite. There's so much good food here. I already ate way too much. I'm taking a little breather. Well, that's enough of a rest. I'm hungry again. Let's eat to the buffet table. And yet you're gonna just stand there. Ah, salutations, Mario. Do you know Frost T here? He's come all the way from the, from the Shiver region, which lies far to the north of here. Princess Peach is such a generous hope, generous and wonderful lady, just as I was told. I was, it was worth coming to visit. Mario, please come visit us in the Shiver region someday. I'm sure I'll do that. All right, we got two people over here. I don't know if I'm going to be doing this, talking to every single character. I think Princess Peach has been looking forward to seeing you since this morning, Mario. She's been restless. <laughs> How cute. Oh, welcome, Mario. The last party was lovely, wasn't it? Oh, by the way, Princess Peach has been waiting for you. All right, I suppose I should head over there. Wait, hold on, that's a penguin. I have to talk to the penguin. Wow, this castle is absolutely breathtaking, don't you know? Don't you think? <laughs> wow, I wish I could stay here at Peach's castle forever. I don't know why that was the voice I chose for a penguin, but it was. Princess Peach went to enter into her private chambers just now. She must be a bit tired. Okay, I suppose we'll go visit. Uh, so many more people. Greetings, Mario. I am the minister of Princess Peach's castle. It's good to see you here. When you're around, I feel like our kingdom is secure. Yep, our future looks bright. Great. I come from a desert town called Dry Dry Outpost. This castle is really lovely, isn't it? Truly gorgeous, so cool and comfortable. I even got a chance to talk to the beautiful Princess Peach. What an honor. When I go, when I return to Dry Dry Outpost, I'm going to tell everyone about it. Hello, Mouse. I'm a, I'm a nomad, nomad mouse, nomadi mouse. I don't, I don't know how I'm supposed to say that. I know it's obviously nomad plus mouse, but I don't know how to connect the two properly. I'm a nomadi mouse, and I come from Dry Dry, dry Desert. Everyone I've met in this town seems incredibly nice. I think I'll make this place my home away from home. <sighs> Does Princess Peach have a special man in her life? She's such a lovely lady. Uh, whoever she loves must be very special indeed. Do you know of a place called Shooting Star Summit? It's near this castle. It's such a romantic place. It's definitely the best place for a date. Trust me, maybe you ought to, you ought to, you know, ask the princess to go there. What's over here? This is Princess Peach's room, but I'm afraid she isn't in at the mo isn't here at the moment. Okay, if you say so. I come from Koopa Village, uh, which is just down the road from here. Oh, I just had the honor of talking with Princess Peach. What a wonderful lady she is. I'm here on behalf of lovely Shiver City. I'm the mayor here, there, you know. I really can't read. This is not a good sign. My goodness, look at the time. I have to go shopping for souvenirs with Frosty. All right, I think I'm just gonna head out. 
That's not a door. It just looks like a door. How dare. Hello. It's nice and quiet here with no guests around. Ah, so pleasant. That's fair. Hello, hello, Princess Peach. Ooh, very soft. Lovely couches. I really can't. Okay. Hi. Princess Peach went into our private chambers just here, just now. But I can't read. Wow, this is not good. <laughs> it's not a good sign. Peach. Hello. Oh, Mario. You came to the party to see me. You're so sweet. Thank you. Hi. I was just resting a bit. It gets tiring greeting all those guests out there. Nobody will bother us here. Shall we relax and chat, just the two of us? Sure. It was a lovely day today, so I'm sure it's comfortable out on the balcony right now. Would you accompany me, Mario? Sure. Uh, that's not a good sign. Um, why is the ground breaking? Oh, that's why. Bowser! Who'd have thunk? Great. Mario, don't just run around and do something. <laughs> oh, we're going to space. What a lovely time. Oh, are you all right, Mario? What in the world was that? Oh my, but look, Mario, it's still daytime, isn't it? But I can see the stars outside. Oh, hi. How's it going? <laughs> Long time no see, Princess Peach. Bowser, but this can't be. It was you who made the ground shake just now, wasn't it? Whatever did you do? <laughs> Yeah, that was me. I've lifted your castle up into the sky. It's sitting on my castle now. Weren't expecting that, huh? <laughs> this castle's under my control now, my dear. Now you will obey me. Not so fast. Huh? What? It's Mario. What a shock. <laughs> Not really. I expected you to turn up right on cue. You're just as annoying as ever. Unfortunately for you, there's nothing you can do this time. Haven't you learned your lesson by now, Bowser? You can never defeat Mario. Why don't you give up already? True, true, I've had my problems in the past, but this time is different. This time I'm gonna win. Okay, tough guy, let's go. All right, here we go. Mario, you can do it. Let's go. All right. Well, how about we jump? Aha. Ow. Haha. -ha. This is really what a battle between the two of us entails. Good old Mario, always fighting. You're a thorn in my side, but today your pathetic little attacks won't beat me. Um, what's that? Take a look at this. Look what I stole from Starhaven. It's the Star Rod. This fine piece of work has the power to grant any wish in the whole wide world. And when I use the Star Rod to increase my strength, even you can't beat me, Mario. Oh, that seems concerning. <laughs> How do you like that, Mario? Um, oh. That's maybe a bit of a problem. <laughs> Is that all you've got? How sad. You'd best take some vitamins, because that didn't hurt at all. 
Wait, please! Don't you dare! Ow! I'm in danger! Yep, just as I sus expected. Mario's no match for the new me. It's not even worth my time to toy with you anymore, Mario. It's time to end this. Here we go, Mario. Good night! <coughs> I really hope we switch away from Bowser soon. I'm burnt to a crisp! Oh! Lovely! Oh no! Mario, get up! Yes! Oh yeah! I did it! I finally did it! I beat my old rival, Mario! Yes! Congratulations on your victory, your viciousness! That's why you're the king! As long as I have this star rod, everything I wish will come true. Now, no one can stop me now. Well, well, well. I guess I might as well get rid of Mario. He's no good to anyone now, that's for sure. Ah! Oh no! Mario! I think that was supposed to be a drawn out Mario, but I, I didn't read it like that for some reason. Ah, well, this is great, isn't it? Just falling through the sky. Lovely. Hooray. Prologue, a play from the stars. All right. Well, we're listening. <laughs> Let's go. Well, we're real beat up. Oh, hello. Who are you? Hi. Do you mind? I'm trying to take a nap. Permanently. Oh, thank heavens. He's been gravely injured, but I think he'll recover. But Bowser has the star rod. Now he's mightier than Mario. It's hopeless. All is lost. I'm definitely not going to remember the voices I give to these guys when I, when they eventually show back up. Everyone just calm down. As long as we keep it together, there's always hope. Now, our fates are in Mario's hands. We must try to revive him. Gather round, everyone. Send Mario your power. Okay. Just get blasted with star power. Phew. That's it. That's all we can do right now. Mario, please get up. Please. Bye bye. Hi. It really sounded like something fell somewhere around here. Oh, well, who could that be? This red shirt, this hat, and this mustache. You know, this really looks like the one and only Mario. It couldn't be, could it? The real Mario? Hey, hey, wake up! Come on, up and at him! Oh no, he won't wake up! But don't just run around, do something! Oh, oh, what am I gonna do? Dad! Goomba! Goombario! Okay. Where am I? Who put me in a house? Mario, can you hear me, Mario? I'm Eldstar, a star spirit. I have something very important to tell you. It concerns the princess and all of the Mushroom Kingdom. But sadly, I haven't the strength to talk to you here. Mario, I need you to have you, I need to have you come to Shooting Star Summit. Please, Mario. We star spirits will be waiting for you at the summit. Oh, okay. 
<sighs> well, that was a nice nap. Oh, Mario! I'm so happy to see you awake! You haven't opened your eyes for days and days! Everyone's been worried sick! This place? This is Goomba Village. It's a tiny village that's just west of Toad Town. The only residents are me and a single family of Goombas. Not much of a town, is it? <laughs> the Goombas in the family are just the nicest folks you'll ever meet. They're the ones who found you unconscious in the forest and carried you here to get better. Okay. Well, I kind of remember that. Huh? A star with a mustache? You're saying a star told you to go to Shooting Star Summit? Yep. No, I saw nothing like that. And I sure didn't see anyone come in or out of this house. I wonder, Mario. Maybe you just had a dream? Yeah, it was maybe a little bit more vivid than a dream. Although, maybe not. It could have been some sort of message from a star spirit. Uh, they live in Star Heaven. Uh, Haven. Haven. Uh, shooting Star Summit is the nearest place to, to Star Haven. So that would make sense. Okay, I see. Who knows? In any case, I'm glad to see you've recovered. I know the Goombas would will be would be happy if you paid them a visit. Blah, 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 blah. All right. Please feel free to come here anytime you get tired. A good nap will work wonders when you're feeling weak. All right. Well, thank you for the offer. Hello. Oh, land sakes, Mario. Uh, so nice to meet you. My, I'm so glad you woke up. I can't tell you how worried I was when you were just lying there asleep for so long. Well, thank you. Hey, Mario. I'm Goob Mario. I'm your biggest fan. You don't know uh, what that what this means to for me to meet you. Seriously. Mario, I know all about your adventures around the world. You've been everywhere. And you always get the best... You always get the best of the bad guys. Every time. You're the coolest. I want to be just like you. Mario, you look better. I'm so glad. I was really worried about you because you were lying there in the forest and you didn't open your eyes at all the whole time. I was the one who found you, you know, Mario. Me. Uh... Goombarina. <laughs> uh, uh, I was in the forest and I found you and then I called Daddy and Goompa and Goombario. And then they came and got you uh, and I'm glad you're better. Great. <laughs> Wonderful. <laughs> Hello. Howdy, Mario. Feeling better? Feel free to rest in our house. <coughs> you what? You have to leave right now. No shooting star summit. Something important, no doubt. Well, I believe that the summit is near Toad Town. You'll have to wait a bit. I have to fix this gate before you can head out out to the east. That earthquake the other day did a real job on it. Did you feel that quick? Shoot, I thought the sky was falling. Just relax and don't worry. I'll have this fixed in a jiffy. Okay, uh, if you say so. Well, I suppose let's head inside. Hi. Oh, Mario. Hello, dearie. Uh, oh, this is... Sorry, this is the grandma. Oh, Mario. Hello, dearie. You may call me Goomba. I'm a Goomba grandmother, so that's where I got the name. <laughs> Have you already met my lovely grandchildren? Aren't they sweet? Especially little Goom Goomba... Goombaria. I don't know how to say words. Why, she looks just like me, like I did when I was young. <laughs> Great. Hello? Hi. Oh, you startled me. Huh? Yes, Mario, isn't it? So, you've awakened at last. Good. Knew you'd pull through. Call me Goomba. I'm the Goomba grandfather, so I'm Goomba. I'm sorry, but would you mind giving me the details later? I'm pretty busy fixing the veranda. I don't know what the voices I'm giving these people are. I'm really... <laughs> I don't know if I will be back here much. 
Hi. Oh, Mario. My dad was looking for you. He said to tell you that he fixed fi finished fixing the gate. So I guess now you can travel east to Toad Town and Shooting Star Summit, huh? All right, cool. Oh, uh, sorry, that's not the voice I gave him. Oh, what a job. Sorry to have to keep kept you waiting. The gate is finally fixed. If you take this road straight ahead, you'll eventually reach Toad Town, the home of Princess Peach's castle. I believe that Shooting Star Summit is just beyond there. It's too bad you can't stay. I feel like I just met you, but duty calls, I know. Come back and visit if you can. Best of luck, Mario. Hey! Oh, this, sorry. <laughs> it's... Okay, it's fine. <laughs> oh dear. Hi. <laughs> ah, my instincts were right. Mario, I can't believe you're on your feet after taking such a beating from King Bowser. You're a hardy one, all right. I was smart to come here to check on you. Wh what What's that, Daddy? What's that weird flying thing? That is a person? <laughs> weird? You rude little... I'm a beautiful Koopa with a beautiful name. Cammy Koopa. Humph. I wish I had time to teach you a lesson, brat. But no. Mario, hear this. It is useless for you to try to save Princess Peach. Ridiculous. Laughable. As you have seen, King Bowser is more powerful than you can e you can deal with this time. Blah, 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 blah. Here's a gift from him. Uh, that's a block. Ah! <laughs> Mario, you will kneel and weep when you see the wondrous change, wonderful changes King Bowser's made. Your world is ours now. <laughs> Don't change. What was that? I didn't even have time to process what I was about to say. Uh, um, I just fixed that gate. Nobody says, nobody said gate to me. Cammy Koopa, that fiend. Did you hear what she said about the princess? <coughs> it didn't sound good. I hope nothing's happened to her. What, what? What? Bowser went and kidnapped Princess Peach? Again? Oh, unbelievable. And now you have to go and go to Shooting Star Summit and help save her, right? Um, this could be a problem. Uh, Dad, we've just got to do something, right? Mario's got to save the princess. Nobody else can do it. Um, oh, here's an idea. Maybe we can break this block with Goomba's big hammer. I think he's using it now to fix the veranda. Go and ask him for it, will you? All right, well, our first little roadblock, but there's a hammer in the world. So we can use this to save. We should probably make sure to do that. I believe I'm gonna call the episode here. So next time we will go get that hammer and uh, head out, hopefully. But for now, that's it. So thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed this episode, please let me know down in the comments below and maybe leave a like. And if you want to catch the next episode as it comes out, go ahead and hit subscribe. But for now, that's it. So, see ya!